Hello, this video is about how to create height maps or alphas with a Nomads Cult version 166. It works also with a version 165, but yeah, 166 is much better. Don't panic if uh, you don't have the beta. Um, you can use the web demo at the moment. It works. No problem. Okay. This is Nomads Cult at the um, web demo version. And yes, you can use it online. No problem. And now I drag and drop a file into it and for Android Android users it it should be possible to open here or import um, the import uh, um, add to scene or open it uh, you can bring in here your artwork and okay have to clean up a little bit the scene. Okay. I bring the object now in position and I use the gizmo. Sorry. We use uh, snapping. Okay, I rotate it. Um, okay. This is a nice view. In the front view, we now see this spaceship. And we bring it with a gizmo move to the origin that the object is in the center of the world. I'm using the, the trackball to navigate. Okay. And when you press the reset button, We have the top view and in the debug menu there's a, a other feature and it's called height map. When you press it you see this. Sometimes you see nothing, only black. But uh, now you can use um, Gizmo and in the matrix here at the bottom you can adjust you can slide here in, in the blue direction and now the height map appears clearer. Okay. This is the height map alpha image you see now on the screen. But sometimes it's a it's better. I turn off the height map. When you deform your object a little bit, when you scale it in this direction, then it, um, yeah, looks bigger. It's only for the height map. And now, when we bring in the height map view again, you see some parts are a little bit brighter. Okay, and the next important thing is here the render resolution. Here you can adjust the setting here and bring it to yeah, max, maximum size. And it, when you use the beta, it's possible to export here um, as a render picture and export it as a PNG. But now we need a trick. Um, we use the view mode, lock the view, position the picture here and now you can take a screenshot 
and crop the screenshot like this. Yes, and save it. Okay. In the normal version, you can test your alpha brush. You can add a plane. I'm hiding the other part. Validate the object. Wireframe is we need more topology, multi-resolution. Let's use a million and use the stamp tool. And let's bring in the new alpha. Symmetry off, wireframe off. And here's the spaceship. It's a little bit grainy, but um, this is not a real problem. You can smooth it out. like this and you can smooth more. Yes, now it should work. Yeah. And now you can trim the object and Yes, make it as a solo object as you want. Okay, that's it. Have fun with sculpting. Ciao.